Hey guys, so it's Jesse. So I got finally got the July loot crate. Um, for once, it wasn't loot crate's fault, and I'm actually starting to wonder whether or not it's ever been loot crate's fault um, that they're so late. Um, only because like they never give me any information beyond the it's shipped crap, which is loot crate's fault or their services fault or whatever. This has actually been sitting somewhere in the city for about three weeks. <laughs> According to my tracking, I've been waiting almost three weeks for it to just get from one end of Toronto to the other end of Toronto. Yeah. I have no idea. I'm still not going to go back to Loot Crate. There will be one more Loot Crate box because uh, this one has a free box. Uh, last I heard, they were prepping it, so I don't even think it's shipped yet. Uh, yeah, we might not get it till the end of September or October, who freaking knows. <laughs> My guess is, is we will end up being able to afford the treats, treats box long before this comes in. So, yeah. And on a side note, before I do this, for anybody who is actually watching these videos, um, I just finished Fan Expo. There was a video of my unboxing. I did end up getting another Walking Dead box, which I unboxed there. It had some pretty cool stuff. Um, it had a hat, and it had the other banner. It says The Walking Dead with Rick Grimes on it. Uh, it wasn't quite as big as the other no. one, thank goodness. Um, then there was a, one or two other items I don't remember right now. But next this year, um, I might be talking through my video. Um, I took a lot of pictures and stuff, and I do a music. I'll do a music type video thing, like music to the pictures on my other video. Um, I will do a video of some kind on here, and I will leave the link to my other channel which will have that video on it um, later this week sometime. Right now, I'm in the midst of reading out uh, BC Andrews, the Dolan Ganger series, so it will be done at some point this week. I don't know when, and uh, next year, I'm actually thinking I might take a camera in and actually take you guys all along, um, so next year, there will be an actual video on here showing, you know, the fan expo. It'll probably be cut and pasted and stuff, because nobody just wants to see... Boring stuff. Boring stuff, exactly. <laughs> so, you know, I'll probably film a little bit of some of the panels I'm in. Not much. Because, you know, I'm there to watch the panels, not videotape them. But, you know, I'll, I'll videotape a little bit of each panel that I'm in. And then, you know, a little bit of the celebrity area and the where you buy your merchandise and the costumes and everything that's there. So, anyways, let's get to it. The Loot Crate for July. Uh, it's a shirt. What is this? Another shirt? Oh. Yeah. Apparently the boxes have shirts. Okay, so let me just put those down properly. So we're going to do this different. We're just going to open it up because that really confused me. So we've got Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, Most Excellent Picture Frame. Okay, you know guys, let me turn this on. <laughs> oh, there we go. And Joe's going to open that up. While he's opening it up, let me go on to the next thing. We have a set of four Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle magnets. So that's pretty cool. It says it's a Loot Crate exclusive. So I think I'm actually going to keep that because yeah, that looks pretty cool. Then an Adventure Time yeah. pen. Which I'm not that interested in. Yeah. Alright, and then this, oh, this is cool. This is the picture frame. Oh, right. I just had him open, so that's pretty cool. I think I'm going to keep everything on this box. This one. Um, oh, that's why there's two t shirts. Okay. Why? You're replacing something? It's a, no, it's a, uh, it's a team up. So we have an Ant-Man t-shirt and a The Wasp t-shirt. So for once, me and Joe will each get a shirt instead of being forced to share the shirts. So this is obviously The Wasp. She has The Wasp. I like it again. <laughs> and this one is Ant-Man. I don't know if you guys are seeing this very well. I'm really trying it. to do as much light as I can, you guys. I know. But that is 
Ant-Man, like when he's being shrunk down and stuff. So, I'm really trying to, hope you guys see that. So hopefully you can see that, because I can't look around it to find out if you can see it or not. And then, the box also does, uh, some sort of adventure time thing where you can fold the box differently and make, I guess, this character, whoever he is. I don't, I don't really know anything about adventure time, but this is an interesting box. So it's actually a box you probably won't toss out. Okay. So that's what came in the July box. It's actually an interesting box. Uh, not really worth much more than the 20 bucks I paid for it, but yeah, well, probably worth a little bit more, but yeah. Just, yeah. So, like I said, there'll be one more Loot Crate box. I feel like I'm really far down. Um, there'll be one more Loot Crate box, which is the surprise box that came with this, the extra box or whatever. And uh, I wouldn't expect that till at least the end of this month. As far as I know, they haven't even shipped it yet, so I wouldn't even actually expect it till like October. Like I said, we'll probably end up with a treats box long before the next Loot Crate box. Um, I've, as I've said in a previous video, I'm no longer doing the uh, bark boxes on here. I am still getting them. But, I mean, you know, it just seems kind of pointless to do them because I'm practically more excited over than my dog. So, I mean, she enjoys the toys and she definitely enjoys the treats, but it just seems completely pointless to, uh, to videotape it, especially since half of my handheld electronics seem to be breaking so much recently. So, keep an eye on the channel for the... Uh, fan expo thing where I will be uh, showing some videos as uh, not no well yeah I, I do have one or two videos that I can put on here as well as mostly pictures and then um, I'll show you the stuff <laughs> in the, the, the second dead walking dead box I got and uh, whatever else I come up with. Um, maybe I'll even talk a little bit about doing the Degrassi tour because I went to the Fox Theater last weekend and I went to the Royal this, well, the previous weekend and then I went to the Royal this past weekend. So I got to meet Pat like half a dozen times in like the last week and it was pretty awesome actually, I'll tell you. So anyways, that will all be in a future video because this is all about okay. So that will be all in a future video. So for anybody who is watching these videos, which probably isn't too many people if any, uh, just keep an eye out later this week and also later this month when I will have the um the treats box. I just need to take the next week or two and start getting some things under control. My finances, my credit card, and uh, I still got to start paying for my Canada's Wonderland passes. Because, um, of course, we all know we need to go there. And for anybody who doesn't know, quick uh, information is that next year they will, obviously, they'll have the new ride. And uh, they're also going to have the new Christmas. Oh, the, yeah, the Yukon Striker, and they're also going to have the um, new Winterfest. So I'm actually going to be buying the Gold Passes, which will get me unlimited visits to Halloween Haunt next year, and unlimited visits to the Christmas uh, Winterfest thing next year. So for anybody who lives under a rock, uh, there's going to be all sorts of new things at Wonderland next year. So look into that, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.